Homies, what's going on? Hope you're having a fantastic day so far, fantastic week. I want to walk you through 22 of the best partner training drills that you can do to improve your football ability. Before we get into the video, I would really appreciate it if you could click that like button, hit that subscribe, I'm trying to reach as many people as possible, help you and your friends become a better footballer and a better person. I know what you're going to say to me, Rick, bro, you need a haircut and you need a new sweatshirt. Trust me guys, I'm working on it. Enjoy the video, I'll see you at the end. Let's take a walk through these 22 partner drills. The first drill is a simple one touch drill where you're working with your partner and you're trying to switch feet every time. So you're playing one touch, trying to switch his or her feet every single time. Next thing, you're just working on a weak foot one touch. So use your weak foot, mine is my left, Kurt is his right, and all you're doing is paying the ball in with your weak foot, staying on your toes, trying to play a nice ball across the pitch. Next thing is an excellent little drill called the triangle drill. You can see, very, very simple. Just make yourself a triangle. And for this variation, we're using two touch inside. So as you see, I'm getting to the front of a cone explosively, taking two touches, back pedaling, and then getting myself to the next cone. Keep that foot up and balance on the other leg. Next one is just a nice little ball mastery, partner ball mastery. So it's a pull behind roll. Great thing to do in small spaces. If you can't get out to a pitch. Also, it's a great thing to do as a warm up. For any session so you're getting every surface ready so make sure to work the right foot make sure to work the left left foot it's just a pull behind roll across roll it across to your partner next one same drill as before triangle drill but just using one touch main goal is to just get up as quickly and explosively as possible and playing that ball nicely back on the ground to your partner your partner's choice, he can either use his hands or he can use his feet. Just work it out before and just make sure you're playing those balls in hard and working hard. Next drill, I really like this one. We created a little slalom. Me, Crony, and Bappy. All you do is use your weak foot, dribble through that slalom, and then you go to the other server and you do a little, little bit of a heading drill. Head the ball here, come forward, touch it, back pedal, he'll throw it and just head it back. Nice little one to repeat. Next one on the beach in Haifa. Wow, it's beautiful. A little chest to head. So your partner is gonna have to really throw that ball towards your chest. You should be aiming at your nose actually. You have to bend your back nicely Get that ball high and head it back powerfully. Next one is just a little nice weak foot two touch juggling. Much harder than you think. Really, really enjoyable. You gotta really, really concentrate the entire time on the ball. Make sure your touch is nice, sharp, and crisp. I really love this one on a recovery day or as a warm up. Next one, same drill as before, a little triangle fitness, but your partner has the ball in his hands and you're lacing the ball back powerfully to his hands. Just trying to stay over the ball and lace it back nicely. Next one, really love this one. Triangle partner drill. So one guy is at the point we're focusing on Baptiste right now. He can take, he should take two touches and the goal of Kroon and I is to deliver really nice hard balls into him to test his touch. Now I'm at the point, similar drill, just different variation. Same exact thing, I'm trying to use my weak foot, my left foot to ping the ball on the crooney. He tries to take one touch every time. Baptiste tries to take two, so he can deliver the ball in powerfully and nicely. But the most important thing is to just get the ball in nicely to your partner. Really zip it in, test, his touch and that's the most important now we got the man at the point so same exact thing i'm trying to just ping that ball and nicely to him to test his touch really nice long passing drill and 
Obviously, it's your choice if you want to use one touch, two touch, test yourself out and see what works best. Same exact thing as before, really like this one, lace to lace, same foot volley. Really good to test the touch. Nice little small space drill that you can do anywhere. Get yourself to a beach if you have it. Definitely not a bad training place. Next one, just another ball mastery drill. It's called a double roll. So as it sounds, all it is is roll cross, roll back, and then play it to your partner. Same thing, inside to inside. Stop with the sole, play it across to your partner. Partner should trap it with his sole. And then repeat the same thing. Try to really ping it in. And then another little partner ball mastery using the sweep side to side. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen this a couple of times before. People call it the Iniesta, the Croqueta, whatever you want to call it. Sweep that ball side to side, play it into your partner with pace, and have him do the same exact thing. Make sure you're really shifting that body weight using the inside of the foot. So now we're doing weak foot, using two touches, just pinging the ball in nicely. Gotta take two touches and really test your partner's touch. You can even use this as a game, play for points, but here we're just trying to improve each other and just ping it in nicely and use that touch to really improve ourselves. Now we got a double inside, one of the harder volleys, but really makes you focus and you really got to shake that foot nicely and ping it back into your partner. Now we're gonna move on to some nice juggling variations. I love these, so these are called the driven balls. So you can take as many touches as you want. Try to take, you know, between three to six and then drive it back into your partner. So like we were working on before with the lace volley, you're gonna do the same thing back into your partner's feet. He has to control it and ping it back. Next one is partner juggling pop-ups. Love this one as well. Take as many touches as you want ping that ball high in the air, pop it up high over his head. And his aim is to take a couple touches, control it, and then ping it back up. Really good to improve your overall aerial control, comfort on the ball, and improve your overall touch and confidence. 20, a little bit of a partner juggling, weak foot one touch, just using the one touch, really key here is that rhythm, that weight of the ball. And you're really gonna test your touch here. Obviously with your weak foot, you always want a lot of concentration and a lot of focus. And now we're going to the alternating lace volley. So a little quick feet shuffle, lace to lace, ping it back into your partner nicely, sharply and smoothly. Get yourself out to a beach if you can, nothing like it. And then we're going chest to lace. Last drill for the day, take it down nicely, chest it down to your lace, lace it in. It's very good, will help with your striking technique, with your driven ball technique. Hope you guys enjoyed them. I appreciate you tuning into the video. I hope you really enjoyed it. I know these partner drills are gonna help you and your partner improve your football ability. I'm extremely confident in that. Once again, thanks so much for your support. If you liked the video, please hit that like, please hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video. Let's have a good week. Deuces.